The book of Psalm 51 verse 7 says, Cleanse me with hyssop, and I will be clean. Wash me, and I will be whiter than snow. Hyssop simply means an aromatic plant, which is used for cooking and for herbal medicine. So if from way back in the Bible, they actually did cleansing, purification with plants and herbs. So what are we talking about today? So why is it that most people say, I, outside prayer, I cannot do any other thing? Please, my brother, my sister, do not deceive yourself. Because all those things started from way back in the Bible. Today, I will be teaching you something in the unfading name of the Most High God. A different dimension of cleansing. That if you carry it out in the unfailing name of the Most High God, you will see things turning around for you. Like 360 degree turn around for you. Has things been rough for you? Like things has not been working? Everywhere you go, you suffer rejection. You suffer hatred. You lack love. Like most times you feel like going, what? What's happening to you? If all those things are your case, then sit down, relax, and listen to what I want to teach you today. First and foremost, please do not carry out any spiritual assignment without making prayers. Without calling upon the name of the Most High God. Do your prayer of mercy. Do your prayer of thanksgiving. Then you bless every item you want to use for your spiritual assignment. In the unfailing name of the Most High God. Because all power in heaven and on earth belongs to him. So today you will be needing just three things for this spiritual assignment. What and what will you be needing for this spiritual assignment? You will be needing lemon. This is lemon. You will be needing lemon. You will also be needing your fortified and blessed sea salt. You would also be needing your block camphor. This is your block camphor. Not the normal conventional camphor. You will be needing your block camphor. For the spiritual assignments. So how do you go about it? You gather those things together. In a bowl. Most preferably a white bowl. And you do your prayer. You call upon God. Bless all those things in the unfailing name of the most high God. We all know that sea salt has this very strong cleansing ability. And properties in it. Then talk about lemon. Lemon is so so strong when it comes to cleansing. Of aura, cleansing of negativity. Talk about so many things that needs cleansing. Lemon works so good for it. So, after blessing all those things, you get yourself. You will be carrying the spiritual assignment out for seven uninterrupted days, preferably at night. You could also do it in the morning. You could do it in the morning first thing in the morning before sun rise or you do it last thing at night before going to bed you boy you know i always advise that you do, you carry out this type of spiritual assignment with the warm water so that those things could infuse its properties and juice into that warm water unlike when you use just an ordinary water for this spiritual assignment so you get your buckets that you want to use for your baths get your bucket fill it up with warm water then you will be needing seven lemon for the seven days you cut your lemon into two make sure you buy a lemon that has juice enough juice in it so you cut your lemon split it into two and you squeeze out the juice into that warm water then after that you get your black comfort you just from the packet you just pick out Pick out one out of the block camphor and you throw it into that warm water. You also get a handful of new sea salt and also pour it into that warm water. Then you begin to mix with your power finger. You begin to mix as you're mixing, you're praying and calling upon the name of the Most High God. And you begin to say everything you want to see and things you do not want to see as you will be carrying another spiritual bath. So as you're batting with your soap and your sponge, you begin to say, Father Lord, as I'm scrubbing myself, I scrubbed out everything that has been standing as a hindrance in my life. Everything that has not been making things to move in my life. Everything began bringing me rejection, hatred, lack of love, 
everything that has been making things to be tight for me doors do not open for me you know what you're passing through so begin to mention them as you're scrubbing your body with your soap when you're done scrubbing you begin to use that water to cleanse yourself to wash off the soap as you're washing it off you begin to say father lord i thank you because all those things are washing away i thank you because everything that has been making things not to work for me is washing away everything that has been making doors to be closed that has been making me to suffer rejection hatred lack of love they are all washing away you begin to mention all those things that you know you really don't want to see anymore in your life and as you point the water upon your body you begin to say father lord i believe in you and i know that all those things are washing away and i will see them no more in my life in my total existence as you do this with faith in the infinity of the most high god for seven uninterrupted days you could do it in the morning or night my dear you will come back and tell me how far you will see the way things will begin to work for you you will see the way that evil veil that has been covering you that has been making people to run away from from you that has been making people not to render you help you will see the way that veil will automatically in the unfailing name of the most high god disappear from your life things will take a new turn around and a new shape in your life thank you for being a part of this broadcast if you know that you like what we're doing please kindly like and follow our page and also please like comment and share our posts so that your family and friends could also benefit from what we are teaching what we are preaching and what we are sharing and letting out to the world god bless you remain blessed and beautiful until i come your way again god bless you